G'day guys, uh, this is Glenn VK4NGA, welcome to the mobile. <laughs> Not in the shack in this video, but uh, couldn't resist shooting a quick video about this. Um, I'll try and stabilise the camera a bit. So, what you're looking at here is um, my Enrico S200 network radio, which I bring with me when I'm out in the car. And I'll just turn it around, I don't want to touch the screen because I want to show you something. So, there it is there. Uh, the speaker is in the back, just up the top there, and um, it's Android. Uh, a lot of people say, what's a network radio? Well, do a bit of research on that. I don't really want to explain that in this video, but what I want to show you is something that uh, I've uh, just set up recently, and it's working an absolute treat. So running the DB Switch um, mobile app on Android, not sure what version of Android this is, but it's probably the latest, uh, auto updates. Uh, I like the S200 because it has a uh, external antenna that really works, which is good for um, for when you're out in the car and so on. And uh, yeah, it's just um, gives you a little bit better um, reception from the uh, cellular network. So I'm running this on um, on 4G at the moment. So out in the car, of course, I'm away from the Wi-Fi. And what uh, the uh, what the guys. The DV switch mobile guys have done is they've added I'm not sure what you'd call it but they've added a part in the uh, in the app where you can um, switch this into uh, the all-star network and it goes direct from the app straight into the network so I'm not actually using my DV switch server at home at all I've got that um, completely disabled on uh, on this side so uh, I've turned all the modes off on that, so it's just sitting there idle. And this is currently connected through Allstar into node 50522. And you can see on the screen there, it's um, talk group 50525 or D-Star XLX500F. So if you're coming on uh, RF, you can get in there. This is the VK3 RBA linked repeater system. So to look up, uh, this network, which is a fantastically put together network by the VK3 guys, uh, just um, go on QRZ and uh, search VK3 RBA and you'll see the network. So, hopefully, I've got the camera right. So, there's a QSO happening now. Now, this is all the linked repeaters are um, FM repeaters down there. So, this is the first time I've actually had FM type audio out of this. Um, out of this network radio, so let's just crank it up. Took place in the championship and uh, won some uh, silver medal, I think. Uh, so it was a proven nice little boat. This fellow is mobile, so it's a bit crackly, just like you would get on a repeater. It's fantastic. If, it, if I had a little bit more time and um, space for a sailboat and all that stuff, I would get probably one of the little catamarans. Uh, last time I took it, uh, uh, took something like that uh, for um, uh, for good sail. It was on Hamilton Island where we had like a honeymoon uh, uh, with my wife. So um, you just book uh, the thing in the morning, and few crazy ones that are uh, not afraid to uh, go. I'll just into wait the for the other station out. to come in. He's um, uh, he's at home. A couple of other guys. Uh, we had so much fun, it was unbelievable. One person sitting on that thing, it was just a simple, uh, I think it's called Hobby or something like that. Single, a single, single uh, uh, catamaran. Just turn around so you can and hear the speaker better. you rise one of the keels and you just sail on the one, that's where the fun begins. It's, just, it, it's, it's fantastic fun, over. Crank it down. So, whoop, dropped it. <laughs> All right, so basically I'll just turn that audio right off if I can. Yep, there we go. So, so this is the uh, All Star um, have available a web transceiver. So, with this 
app on uh, you could put this app on a mobile phone tablet you know I think uh, I think it's available on um, on uh, iOS Apple as well uh, I've never tried it on that because I don't have an Apple gadget but I'm sure it's available and uh, it's uh, it's a great app and the good news with this is um, that nodes that are web transceiver enabled you can see it says ASL WT so that's uh, all-star link web transceiver so nodes that uh, have the web transceiver feature enabled means that what you can do I'll just get another hand going so what you can do is you can uh, use a web transceiver I, th I think you can set up a web transceiver on your um, on your home PC as well so I'm not exactly sure how you do that but if you go to all star link website and have a look you'll probably see some instructions there but what this has done is you could actually in my, my understanding is you could register a node um, in the all star network and get a node number and then once your registration's through, uh, it would you would be registering a radioless node because uh, you don't actually have an RF node. I think you can do that. Don't quote me on that, but check it out. Uh, I'm a bit green on all that sort of stuff. Uh, my registration is for an RF node because that's what I have at home. But this same registration in the back end of this app, it's very easy to set up and uh, within a couple of minutes you're on the network and I've had some great audio reports um, on this particular um, this particular uh, link uh, which is um, uh, node 50522 into the uh, VK3 RBA link system and if you have a look as I said before you'll see uh, the great work that the guys down there have done in uh, linking what would normally be reasonably inactive repeaters and let's face it most of our two and 70 centimetre repeaters don't get much use anymore um, this is uh, what the guys in the UK have done is uh, they've got inactive repeaters they've um, stuck an all-star node uh, into them into the mix and uh, linked them up to various uh, other networks and nodes and uh, the cross-linking in the uh, digital voice um, world now is just amazing it really is to think that I can just bring this with me, no hotspot, nothing else, and link into a network down in VK3 and talk to the guys, just like I would be if I was on one of the local repeaters, is uh, is quite outstanding to think that we can do that. So this is what I bring with me mobile. Uh, occasionally I bring radios with me. I don't normally bring hotspots with me because I use DB Switch, my server at home, to access um, D-Star, DMR, uh, Fusion, and P25 as well. So... Um, so yeah, I just wanted to show you this, guys, because this is an exciting development um, that the uh, the uh, DV Switch guys um, have done. Hats off to them to create an app with um, the ability that this really does. I really think that um, DV Switch is is the uh, the, the secret hero um, in your if you like in the um, in digital voice realm because it does open you to um, you know, to uh, networks that you might have had to buy very expensive, well, you would have had to buy very expensive radios for. So, you know, this uh, this is about a $400 um, gadget, but considering what I can do with it, um, at what's at half the price of an ID52, and uh, I can pretty much, um, you can create a DV switch server just with a Raspberry Pi 3, um, or a 2W, 0 2W, if you can get them, whatever you can get, um, it'll pretty much run and uh, you'll access everything but D-Star. Um, if you want to access D-Star, you've got to put an AMB3000 hat on it or an AMB3000 dongle. But that's a, uh, another video for another time. So I just wanted to show this to you. It's, um, it's a lot of fun. A lot of people say, well, it's not radio, but well, there you go. There's no wires on it, so it's RF. It's just going through the cell network, but that's still radio. So in my view, um, that, that <laughs> that's probably like the old Holden versus, versus Ford debate from the 70s, 80s and 90s but anyway you've got to be old enough to know about that but um, anyway guys just want to show this to you quickly it's a um, it's a fantastic system and uh, hats off to the guys that have uh, done the development on this it's uh, it's absolutely mind-blowing to think that um, you can access All Star this way and also it gives you um, uh, a growing list of um, of nodes if we just go into there we can go into the no nodes list come on 
and you just scroll through the, the nodes. So, you know, there's just, there is hundreds in there. And you, with the push of a button, you can update the node list. So no programming, no code plugs. It's just turn it on, select the all-star um, mode, and uh, bam, <laughs> you're in. All right, thanks for watching, and um, 7 3 to you. Have a great day, and uh, look forward to uh, chatting to you on air. This is VK4NGA.